Hey, Gary. Gary. Nope, that's the end of that. Okay, just I think Gary. I think this is the game wants us to be Spongebob here. Oh. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Hagglesfish. And I'm Katatui101. And okay. welcome back to Let's Play Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Hello Gary, what's new? Hi. This area looks beautiful. Yeah, it does. <laughs> just gossiping. <laughs> and robots. Wow! 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 <laughs> There's a voice crack there. Like me. This is the smallest area in the game. Yeah, I don't remember this area at all. Exactly. I didn't remember this either until my first let's play and the commentary of, like, I walk into this area and then I'm just like, what? Like, what is this area? <laughs> <laughs> Where? I don't remember this being in the, I do now because I remembered it from that let's play. Mm -hmm. And also from the fact that I've done, like, some practice sessions of this game. Yeah. Um, I, that is not worth it for underwear. <laughs> nah. That is not worth ass at all. Can't this area anyway. can be completed in about five minutes. <laughs> I can tell. It seems really small. Also a troll sock down there. Oh my god. That one I can imagine like tripping up a lot of people. I would never notice that. Oh wait, I'm sorry, I made a I made an oopsie. I couldn't see the the bash symbol down there. It was like blending <laughs> into like the red. It blends right in. Yeah, really. Jeez. How can you get up there? Um, you have to go over to the right here. Mm. It's possible. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Oh my god, I'm scared. I like this idea though, that it's like run away from the chain reaction. Yeah, that's creative. Man, I don't remember this at all. Look! Oh my god, it's Patar. <laughs> They changed the art in here. It was originally yeah. just kind of like more generic picture, kind of like how it's like stuff from the show. Yeah, I That's like nice, that. That's a nice touch. Also, do these not go on a timer anymore? It looks like they're stuck here and you have to bash them the other way. Huh. Which I like that way more. That's way better. Yeah, because like, why would they be on a timer? I was looking at how beautiful this level is. I hope that like YouTube compression doesn't completely destroy this, because like this looks <laughs> really nice in person. You know it will. <laughs> also, I don't think you've mentioned this before. So this game runs at full uh, 1080p 60. However, my capture card, oh geez, can either do 1080p 30 or 720p 60. Mm -hmm. I prioritize the frame rate in videos like this. Yeah. So as a result, this is... Re oh, jeez. My God, I can't see the shadow time I was on top yeah, of it. I was just going to say. This is very difficult because I can't fucking see. Like, it looks like you're not going to land on it. Um. Anyway, I prioritize the uh, frame rate for a game like this. So as a result, we are recording this at 720p 60 and then it's being upscaled to 1440p to try to preserve the bitrate mm -hmm. because um, YouTube like ties bitrate to resolution. Yeah. Which I guess kind of makes sense, but it's frustrating if you actually know how video works because mm -hmm. YouTube's bit rates are way lower than they should be. <laughs> Wait, did that not set off the, uh, did that not set off the Thunder Tiki's? No, I don't think they were close enough. I feel like I totally hit it though. <laughs> I feel like the fucking, like, dog one totally hit it. I liked the jellyfish painting up there. <laughs> it was cute. Did you up there? Yeah. Oh, I, I just like jellyfish. Do you want and a pet only, jellyfish? Only in Spongebob. Do you want a pet jellyfish? Yeah, I want to be like Holly I wonder... Bionicle, her pet jellyfish. <laughs> her, like, little pet jellyfish. Yeah. Picture. I really want to play Monog 2 sometime. Same. Because I've never seen the whole game. I played, like, the first, like, Monog 2 intro. sucks. <laughs> Monog 2 sucks. The only good thing is he plays Holly, who's, like, the ultimate thought waifu. <laughs> Yeah, so it should have been fun, but... But there's just, like, no personality in Monog 2. Mm. Which is such a shame, because Monog 2 was, like, super crazy rushed. Yeah, I've heard. But as I was trying to say before, you got me on that little tangent thing. <laughs> was, I actually wonder if you can own, like, a pet jellyfish, like a small one in a tank. Yeah, I mean... Look! Oh my god, it's the meme! They did that, they did that on purpose. Of course, of course, they also have, like, the meme face from the movie. Yeah, I'm sure yeah. they did do that on purpose. Um, yeah, I'm sure they Is there they another did. troll sock down here? No, but there is a troll shiny object. The purple ones. Yeah, with purple the most. Purple is my favorite color. That guy would love this game because purple's the most rewarding. <laughs> I know. <laughs> also, we're done the area. That's it? Yep. Wow. That's literally it. I know there is one more sock we're gonna quickly go get, but mm. because of that, I've decided that we're actually gonna just like keep this as part of the next uh, area too in the same yeah. episode, which I did not do my original let's play. This was like its own standalone four minute video. <laughs> oh my God. Why? You didn't know how to space out videos. Because I didn't. Well, that was a big thing, and also I didn't know how long the next area would be. Ah. Uh, it was basically a blind run. When I did that Let's Play, it was the first time I was playing the game in like seven years, I think. Oh, wow. Yeah, it was like a long time. That's so different than what you do now, because you usually like to know. I play through the game into. like several times over. Mm -hmm. Just for this Let's Play, I played through Jellyfish fucking feels like 10 <laughs> billion times. <laughs> yeah, I've seen you do it. I've learned that area so well. All right, please tell me open up the other teleport box. Thank okay. goodness. <laughs> We need to be Patrick, and the bus stop's only here. Patar. 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 Patari. <laughs> Don't hurt Gary. I won't hurt Gary. Okay. Look how happy he wow. is. Wow. With that belly bounce. Patrick, get in the box. Patrick looks like a little fatter to me, honestly. Didn't Not just my get... new design. 
I thought he got thinner in his new design. I have no idea. I don't. I haven't seen SpongeBob episodes since like 2007 ish. Yeah. Around the time I got rid of cable. All right, so there is one sock hit in this area. I believe it's back here. Mm. Oh my god. I know, it was the strict ass time limit. I know. That's like, I guess they changed the time limit for a lot of his, uh, his freezy lake parts. There we go. Because in the original, you could get almost all the way back without, uh, time limit mm -hmm. expiring. Yeah. It's because you also move so much slower on the ice now. Yeah. And then we're actually going to save Patrick again because you do need to Patrick for the next area. Mm -hmm. With, like, one exception. I, I can't, I like just like this. Why is it just like a black void? Why can't you see the level out there? I know. I wish you could jump over that gate. <laughs> That's probably like too far though. This is actually one of my favorite uh, little sub areas. In the oh, do you see the road like freeze up there for a second? Yeah. This is one of my favorite sub areas of the game. This is the uh, Goo Lagoon Pier. Here's a little trivia fact for you. In an earlier version of the game, uh, like very early, they were planning to do... Why can you go back here? They were planning to have Glove World as a level. Oh. So it's speculated that this is what was left over from the Glove World level. Oh, that would be you cool. You kind of put in Goo Lagoon as a pier. For example, I have trouble thinking of areas for Goo Lagoon, given yeah. the fact that one of them was just a generic cave. <laughs> I love the atmosphere here. No, I do too. Look at this. Look at that kid. I, I think I know why he's down. <sighs> oh no, I see him back there. <laughs> you see him? <laughs> Ahoy there, Patrick! It is I, Joe White Crabs. Joe White Crabs run the carnival? I run this carnival to lure in the kiddos, me boy -o. Oh my god! It's my little plan. It's me little plan. Don't tell anybody, Patrick. I'll give you a big reward. You know what that means. Goodness gracious, I'm not... Please stop with this Joe White. I He's already dangerous. It's not me, it's, it's Joe White Crabs. I am tempted to go out there and try to get that, but I know since there's no shadows in this game, I'm not gonna be able to. Yeah, I might not risk it. Uh, okay, so this is actually kinda cool. You're supposed to use the watermelon to take out the ticket booth here. Uh-huh. But you can use him. Oh my god. Bam. Slay <gasps> you with your brethren. Oh, that goodness they animated this. I was kind of excited just to clip to be broken. <laughs> I wouldn't how they put didn't that bother, bother animating the, uh, what you call it, the, uh, the lighthouse earlier. Yeah. Oh, go on the Ferris wheel. All right, should we go back to Joe White Crabs for a big reward? Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, I don't know. Why not? I don't trust him. But he said just to take out the, uh, <laughs> he said take out the ticket booth. Not exactly what I had in mind. <laughs> I hope in my mind? insurance covers all this. I hope I my insurance covers all this. Not me insurance? <laughs> yeah. Oh, God damn it, Joe White. I mean, dangerous. Why does he I sound Irish? <laughs> it is I, Joe White Crabs. <laughs> I'm Irish. <laughs> I have to lure That's... in the Irish children. The <laughs> leprechauns, me boyo. I'd like me a good spicy leprechaun, me boy -o. There is a part in the game where, like, Joe White Crabs laughs, and it sounds just like that. It doesn't have anything... It's like Mr. Krabs is, like, the iconic aga ga 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 laugh. Yeah. And it, this, this, like, imposter crab goes... <laughs> it's not R-R-R. Like a dog. <laughs> it's aga ga 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 Dogs be like... <laughs> What is the point of letting you go down here? It's fun. The That's all there is to it. <laughs> That's all there is. There's literally no purpose to that. No, it's just fun. Patrick's, Patrick's having a good time. <laughs> Patrick's enjoying it. But, like, I love the fact that you can do that. You scared the birds. Oh, it's okay. I just love the fact that, like, there is no purpose to that, but you can just do it. You yeah. Because, like, as a kid, I just played around this area so goddamn much. The Goo Lagoon was easily my favorite level as a kid. Mm -hmm. I feel like this is something that if I were a kid playing this, I would just spend so much time in this area. No, it is, like, enjoyable. Uh, there we go. It's Wacky like, where are the tiki's? Patrick is destroying them. Well, that's what you're supposed to do. Is that part of the game? Yeah, you're Wackatiki. <laughs> See? I think I missed one. No. Oh, I almost got them all in one cycle, too, Aww. damn it. Yeah, look, he's like, eh, eh. <laughs> Stupid <laughs> troll tiki. Ouch. Sock. Also, as I know from uh, playing this as a kid, you can come back with the cruise bubble and take them all out underneath the pier <gasps> as SpongeBob. But then when you won't get the sock, and then when you hit the uh, switch there, they all respawn. Oh. So I guess you could come here to grind shiny objects. Yeah, probably. Oh no, it's her. I'm not sure if it would be like efficient though. Oh my gosh, she's just here in front of the porta potty. Killer. Oh my gosh, the robot. She's so happy. She's like, oh, my hero. Ow. I feel like she has a deep voice. <laughs> oh, my hero. It's my hero. 
<laughs> she talks like actually one of the last time I actually have character introducing. Talks like that. <laughs> oh my hero. I love this too. Like there's like the uh the like teacup ride. Yeah, that's cute. Also, what hit you? I have like one there. of the teacups maybe. Oh. <laughs> I love dangerous. the use of colors here. Like there's too much fog, I feel like, but I love the use of the colors in this all. This looks so pretty. Yeah. I feel like you can see shit out there. Like, that's oh. nothing. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, is that supposed to be something? But as a kid, I would probably spend like hours speculating about what that could be. <laughs> I used to do that in games, you know? Yeah. Like in the opening to Mario Sunshine, there's, in the opening to Mario Sunshine, you like see other islands in the distance, like mm -hmm. a crab shaped one and, and uh, an octopus shaped one, so there's like the dolphin shaped one. Oh yeah. And I spent so much time as a kid theorizing they'd make sequels on those islands. Really? They don't. I mean, I did that too, with uh, like the shitty video games that like I played. Pets Cats too. Yeah. So this here is a ski ball. I love ski ball. Yeah, you need to use SpongeBob's Bubble Bowl to play it. Um, there's wow. no reward for this. It just gets you shiny objects, and unfortunately, I don't think it's quick enough to really be worth it for grinding. Yeah. It's just like it's way too slow. It's a good idea, but not worth the. Uh, not worth the hassle. Not worth the hassle of it. No, not at all. <laughs> a throw fruit though. Ooh, they actually made this look like ice skating here, and not oh. like uh metal like it did in the original oh jeez oh jeez get away <laughs> oh my god they're right on your butt oh. Ah. oh i need to get the uh the oh. rope machine out there that's hard they're yeah they're keep... like so aggressive yeah they're gonna keep spawning that's that's difficult one thing i'm noticing the rope machines are spawning them way faster in this version and the rows in general seem to like be more aggressive yeah which i like those are good changes but yeah oh damn it why, why did he like shoot that so delayed i was hitting the button and he wasn't throwing it yeah and by the time he threw it, I had to turn around because I was about to fall off the edge. <laughs> Ugh, that's a little frustrating. It's difficult, difficult, lemon difficult. I feel like I almost had it that time. It was just that, like, he was turning around too late. And also, Patrick keeps aiming the watermelon at those guys. Oh, that was my Bob. fault. I'm gonna cut ahead till we get this. Come on, come on. Why isn't the targeting, like, letting me... Yeah. How close do you want me to go? I can't get close precisely because there's robots attacking me in ice physics. <sighs> There we go, got it. Nice. Got it. Fuck that. Yeah, that was just like <laughs> unnecessarily frustrating due to the change in the robots and they didn't compensate for here. Yeah. Like they either had to rebalance this part or just like leave it closer to the original. Um, we're actually gonna go back to be SpongeBob real quick. Oh, cool. Because there's uh, something we have to do with SpongeBob up, up here. So we'll meet you back here. All right, now back here with SpongeBob. Unfortunately, we only have to be SpongeBob for a short amount of time for it to go back to being Patrick. Mm, you're not really SpongeBob a lot in this area. No, the first area is funny because you're like exclusively SpongeBob. Yeah. Wait, they moved them. Um, those guys used to be like right above uh, this patch here. Oh, why? And they also used to be a lot closer to the ground. You used to be able to hit them with this. And I was always frustrated. You actually couldn't break those tiki's with the uh, bubble bash move. Huh. You had to use the, uh, what you call it, the slide to break them. Oh. Uh, huh. I, I was going to say, is that supposed to be there? I, I don't know. I mean, stuff like that is pretty normal in games. Yeah. And we need to be SpongeBob in order to get up uh, to do what we need to up here. Madame Fishy, the fortune teller. Madame Fishy. I want to take a look at those booths after we do, uh, get this golden spatula. Yeah. Boing. Boing, boing. Oh, no. SpongeBob. God damn it, SpongeBob. Uh, <laughs> bounce? That was funny. All right. I was confusing. I spent so much time as a kid trying to get on top of this ball, too, which was fairly easy to do in the original, but looks like it's not possible here. Mm. Oh, no, a bungee. Yeah, we need to do SpongeBob for this bungee. Oh, okay. I literally didn't hit a single button. I'll take it. We'll take... Where's his nose? Oh, there it is. I didn't see his <laughs> nose for a second there. <laughs> you said it's like, where's his nose? <laughs> no, that's an integral part oh, of his oh, character oh. design. I... Why does your shadow not appear oh, until you're right on top of the object? God. That's just like... Did they not playtest that at all? There's no shadow until you're directly above it. You can't tell where you are in 3D space. That's really aggravating. Like, there's yeah. absolutely no reason for it to be like that. <sighs> and also, that's the length of loading screen whenever you die. Mm. I do like how they added the uh, concession stands in there. So oh, that's cute. There's food in there. I wish you could go in there. Coral candy. Ticket booth. There's prize games. Toss a can. Yeah, I re you got me a giant snake at one of those. <laughs> yeah, I won, games, I won you one of the, the gigantic... Uh, like one of those huge, like, just like snake plushies. <laughs> yeah, that one is big, too. It's like six feet long. It's like yeah. surprisingly big. I love it. <laughs> I just like, I just love snakes. Oh, snakes are adorable. Snakes are like the biggest derps in the world. I know, they're just noodles. 
<laughs> they are. I don't I, remember this part at all. There's like no reason to do this except to get um that. Oh. <laughs> did I not get? Oh, there we go. So did I not get the purple? Can you go up the other way? Like. Uh no, because it's like too high. Oh uh, yeah, that's too high. Clam sickles. That sounds disgusting. That's like bird sickles. Oh my god. That's terrible. I mean, people eat mudden. Oh, yeah. that's lamb. Mudden's oh, lamb. Oh, yeah. They eat, uh, like, turkey legs. I think <laughs> mudden, that's mudden's true. lamb. <laughs> I don't think it's that out of the question. Yeah, it just sounds like it tastes disgusting. Well, that's because you're thinking of what clams taste like to us. You're not a bikini bottomite. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Is that what they're called, bikini bottomites? Or oh my god, that bus drove off the edge. Oh my god, they're all dying. I feel like there's no one else on the bus, though. <laughs> it's, it's just the guy driving it. Bam. Wait, wait, I couldn't hit a robot into him. I couldn't hit a robot into him. Oh I don't God. like how they changed the G-Love. Yeah. It's like just, they just made it less interactive. They made it so you have to do something very specific or it doesn't work. That's so frustrating. Whoa, whoa, did that just open the box back there? No, oh, I didn't notice. I don't remember if I opened that. I feel like I did open it, but it looked closed until I got near that one. Huh, that's weird. Maybe it closed again because I died, and then, like, it reopened because I did touch. Patrick, get in. <laughs> Patrick's hitbox so is too fat. wide. It's, like, hard to get him through there. <laughs> Dumb fatty. Ahoy there, Patrick. Have you come back for oh. Joel White crabs? I skipped what he said by accident. Oh, no. <laughs> he said, here is your reward. Oh. Okay, we're not missing much. <laughs> it's actually, like, a little peppy if I have, when uh, the jump button is also the skip button. Oh, yeah. Because I like to jump in games a lot. And I'll accidentally skip dialogue sometimes because I'm jumping. <laughs> like, I do that all the time by accident, and that's, like, kind of frustrates me. At the very least, it'd be, like, a grace period where you can't skip dialogue in, like, the first second or two. Yeah, that'd be nice. You see him jump out of the box before he, uh, <laughs> teleported? Patrick, being a little preemptive there. <laughs> He's ahead of the curve. Oh, this is gonna be fun to do on the new ice physics. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's... I remember really liking this part. But it's gonna be a really strict time limit, isn't that it? That freezes the entire <laughs> ocean? <laughs> That works really fast. Wasn't there a book about that? Where, like... Yeah, the, uh, the, Cash Cradle. Yeah, the entire ocean. Yeah, just spoil, spoil the ending. Oh, sorry. Oh, that's a great <laughs> book, though. Yeah, at the end, the Ice Nine falls into the ocean, freezes the entire ocean, everyone dies. Oh, my God. It's a book about, like, nuclear warfare. It's a really mm -hmm. good book. I really want to read that. I know how it ends, apparently, but... Yes. <laughs> yeah, I, like... I don't trust new ice fizz. You can't no. go that quick on it. You walk so slow. Oh, you could slide on your butt. I really want to go out. I think it's just Skybox. I don't think it's actually modeled. Yeah. Because, like, it doesn't look like I got any closer to it while I was walking, so I'm pretty sure that's just part of the background. Mm. I hope you'll find a way to, like, disable the hand in uh, this version, too. Oh, so you can go out of bounds. Oh, oh, that was so fun watching you go out of bounds. I went out of bounds every... I, like, went out of bounds back there and, like, got to, like, the, uh, the <laughs> what you call it, the sandcastle out there, yeah. but, like, from the pier, so it was, like, the low poly. It looked, like, half finished. <laughs> that was so... F I love that. I wonder if I can, like, throw that on there first. No. Oh, it oh, works. No, it worked. Awesome. Sweet. That's a great change from the original. The original, uh, it would just sit on top of the ice, and when the ice melts, it would just, like, despawn. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. Well, that's a good change, then. That's a good change, because that, like, feels more organic. Yeah. And then with that, we're actually pretty much done Goo Lagoon. I really like how all these levels, like, loop back to the start after you, uh, complete them. Mm-hmm. Because, for instance, boing. Oh, my God. Boing extreme. Here we are. Back at Goo Lagoon. The robot just beating himself on the head repeatedly. They're like really creepy sounds playing. I think that was supposed to be the lights from the uh, lifeguard towers. Ah. Uh, Do I need a cutscene showing? <laughs> Do it's gotta show all. Oh, of them. I kind of. That's actually kind of nice. Oh wait, what are they for? There's so there's a way to get back there, which oh. is the same as the original. But now there's a way to bounce to here from the beach. I like that. That's a nice. Oh change. yeah. That's something the original definitely didn't have and like could have used. Mm -hmm. But the only way back to this island was to go back through the pier again. So I'm curious, in the original, you couldn't hit this button, and you can only hit the other one. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it doesn't look like it does anything. Aww. But in the original, it was, like, already pressed in, so it didn't look like you could hit it. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. And? It's gonna explode. Bam! Oh my god. That was, like, not satisfying. There's no sound effect. <laughs> yeah. I want to tell you something funny. In the original, I couldn't figure out the tower puzzle either, as a kid. Mm -hmm. So I came back with the cruise bubble and just shot him from the beach. <laughs> And that's, that's how I beat amazing. it. That's how I beat this challenge. That's amazing. Also, uh, you're locked here. The original, you could, like, jump there. I'd just do, like, do a second jump right over Larry. He'd just shoot, like, way oh. over to the parking lot. Oh, my gosh. Just right over Larry. Yeah. Larry's like, oh, there he goes. 
the shooting star. Living like Larry. Totally. Thanks for your help, SpongeBob. SpongeBob just doesn't say anything. So Larry's like, like, yeah, whatever, Larry. Larry's like, thanks for your help, SpongeBob. You did a great job. Here's a golden spatula. So I was like, and Larry's like, uh. Anyway, uh, <laughs> thanks for your help. And so I'm just like, I just want to make sure did we get every sock. Yes, we did. Oh, nice, hundred nice. percent. Complete this area. Awesome. Well, I think that would make a pretty good part to end off this episode. So why don't you say we pack it all up and head home from the beach? Oh darn. It's always the. Always the worst part, isn't it? I know, because when you're all gross and sandy, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, I always feel disgusting after going to the beach. I know. Sunscreen and sand is just nasty. Yeah. Nasty shit. Especially, like, the bay by where your grandmother lives. <laughs> that bay is, like, it's kind of charming. The water is opaque. Is. Okay, but that's how, like, most ocean water is. I've swam like, where it's completely here. clear, and you can see all the fish. It's beautiful. <laughs> I'm a peasant. I've never, I've never yeah, seen that. Yeah, you peasant beach. See you all in the next episode. <laughs> Bye-bye.